What's up, y'all? It's your boy Gerard Green. There is no other way to get into this video. I wanted to do something dramatic, like some big dramatic reveal, but you see what it is. I cut my locks off, a lot of them off. Um, and this video is really just to give you guys an explanation. Not thought you. I feel like you owe you're owed an explanation. You deserve one um, because y'all been rocking with me for my entire lock process. And um, I want you to keep rocking with me because I still got locks. I still, they still here, you know. I just, so, um, yes, I did cut my locks for those of you who still, you know. Um, I, it happened a week ago. About a, I'm going to do that. Um, I'm just going to get into it. You know, there's, let's just do it. So, um, I came back to Texas A&M University to finish my undergrad degree. Uh, and I needed a change. I needed something different. And I didn't know what it was. You know, I didn't know what it was, but my hair is getting really heavy. Not that that bothered me, but it was just something about the weight. It was different than just the physical weight. It felt, it felt a little spiritual, emotional, you know. I mean, nine years almost of growth and a lot of experiences, you know, um... It tends to weigh on you. <laughs> Pun intended. Whatever. So, I decided to cut my hair. I went back and forth. My best friend Abel was kind of like, you know, um, you're not going to do it. You're not going to do it. You're not going to commit to it. Because I've been talking I've been talking about this for about a year now. I've been talking about cutting my hair for about a year. And uh, I always chicken out. But first, I want to shout out to Lex Lanson and to Not Locks. Thank you so much, Um for shouting me out, making a video. You're one of my favorite YouTubers. And uh, Lex Lanson, my homeboy. Um, thank y'all for the love. And thank you to everybody who has shown me love and support because this is a major change. Um, I wake up every morning kind of like, you sure? Um, so I cut my locks last Friday. Oh, I got my locks cut last Friday. I went to a barber, set in the barber, um, an appointment with the barber, rather. Excuse me. I'm talking rather fast because. I don't know how much space I have on my iPad, so uh, I set an appointment. I went and got in the chair, and the barber said, "You, you sure, fam?" I said, "Yeah, man." And shout out to my barber, shout out to John Balboa, my barber um, at Mike's Barbershop, College Station, Texas. I'm gonna tell y'all a real story, so <laughs> I hope I hope you don't get mad. But anyway, like he he started cutting my locks off, and I saw him fall to the ground, and. You know, people, I even I thought that, no, I didn't. People thought that I was going to cry or be sad, but I wasn't. You know, when it's time to, when it's time to move on, it's time to move on. And so I sat there and I, I was like, oh my gosh, it's really, it's really happening. And then he started shaving and um, he started shaving and I, I was kind of, seeing my reflection in the other mirror and it wasn't looking mm. when he finished I kind of looked like that and so not really like the weekend more like the weeknight kind of <laughs> and I was like oh no so I was kind of I was kind of I, I looked real hit and my friend Abel will tell you I looked real hit I, I came home and kind of styled it a little bit cut a little bit on the sides you know you know add a little extra touch to it but I'm still Still in transition, you know, just kind of doing my own thing with it. But yes, I cut my hair. It's here in a bag. I did. I did not donate it or anything like that. Here it is. <laughs> it smells good. It still smells good. You know, I wasn't stanking or nothing like that. But um, yeah, uh, that's one of them. It's, they're braided. I braided them together. Anyway, um, it was time and. I'm going to always have locks to some degree. You know what I'm saying? Like, whether it's this or I'm, I'm going to still grow my hair out. I just needed a kind of a fresh start. You know, I feel good. I feel sexy. I feel sexy with the long hair, but, you know. People have been asking me, do you miss your hair? Do you miss your hair? Why would you do it? Why would you do it? I can't believe you did that. You know, we all have our own walk. We all have our own journey. And, and, and just because you can't believe I did it, like, that doesn't mean that it didn't happen because it did. They don't. Um, but a lot of people thought that I was, that it was, it was fake. It was photoshopped pictures. And I was like, don't nobody, I've done it before. I was, I was about to say, nobody had time for that, but I've made photoshopped pictures of me looking bald head, but, um, I'm still, I'm still going to rock locks. I just, you know, I just needed 
something else. I needed to start over a little bit. Um, um, I like it. I like it a lot. I think it's me. Um, it's my style. And I just want to encourage anybody out there who, you know, growing locks, you know, who want to grow locks, do it for yourself, you know. And you can reference my old videos. I'm still the OG. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm still an OG now, but, uh, you know, um, your journey, let it be your own. Like, I, I decided to cut my locks and redefine my journey, just reroute it, you know. And I'm still going to have locks. I'm still going to make lock tutorials, lock videos, tell me what I put in my hair, because I got some real, some, some stuff, man. This stuff smelling real good, too. You know, um, I guess I get 360. I, don't, I ain't really taping in the back or whatever, so, you know, but just so you know that it's not pinned up in the back, this is me. I ain't seen the video. If I ain't like that, I'm not I'm gonna edit it out if I ain't like it. But yeah, man. So this is all my hair. Look at that. Oh, it look crazy, don't it? Stuck in the basement, sitting on the tricycle, girl, getting on my nerves. Going out of my mind, I thought she was fine. Don't know if her body is hers. <laughs> Shout out to Will Smith on that one, but anyway, man, y'all, I do want to thank y'all so much for supporting me and always encouraging me. Um, my yoga journey, school journey, life journey, lock journey. I'm still rocking locks. I'm very proud to rock locks, no matter how long or how short. I'm still your boy. I'm still the OG. Uh, <laughs> but um, do you? Do you in the best way you know how? You know, a lot of at, at first I will say that I didn't want to cut my hair because I was afraid of what people were gonna think. Well, then I realized I didn't grow my hair for other people. I grew my hair for me. Like I live my life for myself. You know, let me get off that soapbox. You know, what I'm saying? <laughs> almost took y'all somewhere because people been trying me. Um, you know, how people. Your name is like free sample. People constantly trying you. You know, what I'm saying, <laughs> but. Um, for the most part, it's been all love, you know, and it's been a lot of surprise, you know. Brother getting chose a little bit, you know. <laughs> but, uh, man, I just want to, again, thank y'all so much for supporting me. And please continue to show support. And I'm going to continue to make videos and show love and let y'all know what I'm doing. But right now, this is what it is. What's up? Got my locks look cool. I'm just being silly, but. Yeah, so I'm going to get my homeboy to put a part in there like that, you know what I'm saying, so I can get ready for this, you know, I'm going, I'm, I'm stepping out this weekend, <laughs> you dig? <laughs> but, um, yeah, that's it. I, I know I'm all over the place, but I just wanted to formally say, yes, it's true, I cut my locks, but it ain't over.